Now, let's talk about the girl child. The attainment of the Sustainable Development Goal 5 has been hinged on gender equality and the empowerment of the girl child as a future woman. In spite of the global statistics by the WHO that shows about 6 million girls aged 10 to 19 possessing limitless individual potentials, the girl child continues to face challenges in many countries of the world, including Nigeria. Correspondent Basi Itai Pang examines the untapped potentials of the girl child and her prospects for the future. And we promise to make Nigeria proud if given the opportunities. That is what every Nigerian child wants. The opportunity to let her voice create a future. A voice that will change the unfair and unequal treatments given to her by the society. We lived around the world that a girl's education ends in the kitchen, but that's not true. Women today are great leaders. No way you tell me a girl's child education ends in the kitchen. There are so many women today who have made it, world figures that are women. Their education didn't end in the kitchen, yes? So there's this mentality that, okay, as a girl, it's scripted that at a certain age you get married, but I won't go with that. The need to take the girl child off the street to the classroom to give her a future in line with goal 5 of the SDGs is another area of concern as the world marks another international day of the girl child. This is to emphasize the importance of the girl child in nation building. The girl child is the mother of tomorrow. She is a child today, but tomorrow she'll be the mother, and the role of a mother is very significant. Well, for me, the girls in the rural area need to be taught. They are the ones that really deserve to be encouraged to enroll in school. They need to be developed. Their right has to be protected. Empowerment is another way in which we can reduce the hawking on the street because it makes them prone to rape and other exploitative practices. I feel disturbed when I see my fellow girl or student walking on this road. The lockdown as a result of COVID-19, stakeholders say, impacted negatively on the girl child and stressed the need to put an end to some harmful traditional practices against the adolescent girl. As girls assert their powers worldwide as change makers, there is every need for the world to support them live free from gender-based violence. Let the girl child be counted, invest in her, in her present, in her future, for her to make the, uh, the required change that we all desire to see. There is a general call to action for radical, social and political change to pull down barriers of discrimination and prejudice that continue to hold the girls back.